children today we are going to do this question in EBS uh, chapter what if it finishes and this is a important question it can come in five mark question and it involves a bit of mathematics so that is why it can become a little bit confusing to you so in this question two bar graphs are given bar means all the these kind of boxes and this is a graph so this is for year 1976 and this is for the year 1996 so here uh, how many houses out of 100 use it so if they have taken 100 houses here also and here also in both the years which has a 20 year gap 1976 to 1996 and uh, some fuels are written so there is a change in fuel use so we will see uple LPG, Uple and Wood, LPG and Kerosene, Coal, Electricity and the same fuels and how the use of these fuels have changed over the period of 20 years. So first question very easy. In, 19, uh, in year 1976 out of 100 how many houses used Uple and Wood? So how many houses used Uple and Wood? In 1976 it is written in the year so we will use this graph not this graph. We use 1976 graph and out of 100, how many houses used Uple? How many houses? Just what is written on the top? 84. So here it will be 84. In the year 1976, 84 houses used Uple and Wood. Second question, which was the fuel used the least? The least in 1976. The least used is electricity. The lowest. So it is the answer is electricity. In se third question, 1976, LPG and kerosene were used in dash houses. In 1976, LPG and kerosene are used in 10 houses. And in 1996, this increased to 1996, it has increased from 10 to 18. It has definitely increased to 18. This means that in 20 years, their use increased by dash percent. So if you have not learned about percent, this is very easy. First, we have to find out how much difference has been there from 1976 to 90, uh, 1996. So how much have increased? How many houses have increased? 18 minus 10 there has been an increase of 8 houses in 20 years then what we will do to find out the percentage this whatever is the change divided by the change divided by the previous number of houses what was the previous previous was 10 so 10 and for percentage always multiply it by 100 so what we will get 80% anything any change for change we always minus it we always find the difference change divided by previous value what is whatever was the previous value into for percentage percentage means 100 so multiply by 100 whatever we get that will be the whatever percentage that it is Next question, out of 100, how many houses were using electricity in 1996? So in 1996, how many houses were using electricity? 5. So answer is 5. 5 houses were using electricity in 1996. Last question, again percentage question. Which fuel was used the least in 1996? The least fuel now used is coal. Earlier it was electricity. In 20 years gap it has become coal. So it was the coal and what percent of houses used it in the year 1976? In 1976 what percentage of houses were using? So percentage here in 1976 we will take the whole of the houses. The whole percentage the whole number of houses is 100. So for this, we will use, we, what we will do, number of houses using coal, 
फाइव डिवाइड बाय टोटल नंबर ऑफ हाउसेस व्हिच इज हंड्रेड व्हाट परसेंटेज परसेंटेज वी नो मल्टीप्लाई बाय हंड्रेड सो हंड्रेड माइनस हंड्रेड वी गेट फाइव नाउ सपोज सपोज देयर वर इंस्टेड ऑफ हंड्रेड हाउसेस we had 200 houses if we had 200 houses what will we do we will simply write down how many houses were using coal five so five houses were using coal divided by number of houses in 1976 now the number of houses here is 200 so 200 For percentage, whenever it is there, always multiply by hundred. Zero 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 cancel. Zero zero cancel. Two. This will come two point five percentage. So you can see earlier because the total number of houses were hundred in nineteen seventy six. We divide by hundred. Now in this question we had total number of houses two hundred. That is why we divided by two hundred. If we had five hundred houses, we can divide it by five hundred. So if we had five hundred houses, five hundred houses, houses, what we will do? Number of houses having coal divided by number of houses into hundred. What we will get? One percent. But in the previous question, but in this question, we had to see the change. How much has increased? That is why here we use change. So eight. Divided by the previous number was ten and two hundred. Suppose if the previous number was twenty, what we will do? If this was twenty, suppose this was twenty, two zero twenty, and this LPG was suppose twenty eight. What will be the change? The change would have been twenty eight minus twenty. Change would have been eight. And then how many percentage would have increased? Eight divided by previous value twenty. Previous value was twenty. And for percentage always divide by hundred. This cancel this. Two, four is eight. Forty percent. So here the answer would have become forty percent of houses. There has been an increase of forty percent of houses. If it was twenty and this was twenty eight, because we have to now the previous value would have become twenty. So, I hope you understood. If there is any doubt, please ask me in the comments.